Mantis from Technical Effects here, and today I'm gonna be sharing some um, personal development and productivity tips as I always do. And today's topic is how to make yourself more productive at work. So, this is something that a lot of people encounter whilst trying to chase their dreams and chase their goals, but uh, sometimes they plateau and they hit a brick wall where they can't make themselves more productive the procrastination starts creeping in and they don't know how to overcome it so there are some cues in your everyday life that you need to consider and whilst identifying those cues uh, uh, you will be able to tackle them and observing them and making conscious choices about uh, your own productivity and how you shape your destiny and how quick you want to get to your goal in life right so the first thing that I would advise for everyone to do is to separate the places where you rest where you exercise and where you work so this is something that I have encountered myself as well um, basically I can't do a lot of productive work whilst I'm at home or in my room because this is the place where I rest right so the environment where I rest already signals my subconscious mind um, to relax right so what I usually do um, if I have a day off and if I want to do some productive work, I might go to the office or I might go to a coffee shop. I will completely change my environment to keep myself productive because I will know uh, that I'm just focusing on the fact that I need to do productive work and going to a specific place where I will be just working uh, will not make myself feel like I want to rest in that place right so this is why I don't even exercise at home uh, I don't do a lot of productive work at home I might as well go somewhere else and do productive work there because home and my room for me is just for resting and relaxing and that's what I do so when you go to the gym and when you go to exercise that's another way to actually um, uh, program your subconscious mind in order to uh, set that specific place just for exercising because one thing you won't be working there um, you won't be doing productive work I don't know if you're a PT that's completely different and another thing you won't be resting in the gym right so making that effort uh, of going somewhere uh, and basically preparing yourself to do either work either exercise or rest uh, will make yourself more productive in that way so another thing that I would like to point out is um, you need to tidy up your working area. So uh, if, your de if your working desk or your room um, where you usually do work is messy and you can't find anything around, uh, it might actually stress you out slightly. Uh, you might think like, ah, oh, it doesn't actually affect me, but it does. Uh, there are several studies on it uh, made by psychologists and um, social scientists. Basically, um, messy environments stress out people. So tidying up your room, tidying up your uh, working, uh, working place, uh, will not stress you out as much and you it, it will make you more productive in that way and the third tip that I would like to share with everybody is to prioritize on the most important tasks first although the most important tasks uh, can be also the most difficult but you have to identify which tasks actually bring the most impact in your life right so for example if you have some petty or small tasks to do um, if I were you I would rather postpone them because uh, they're not that crucial when it comes to um, achieving your goals so instead focus on the tasks that have the biggest impact in your life right so focus on those tasks first and the little tasks later on might actually not even seem so significant so uh, I have this basically theory of how do you eat a big elephant and I've been sharing it with the students on golden attitude course so how do you eat a big elephant what you do because you can't eat 
the entire elephant straight away you need to chop it up into pieces right so this is how you achieve your goals you chop the big goal into pieces um, and you try and prioritize on the most crucial tasks first and then later on you'll be able to enjoy the little pieces that have been chopped up and this is how you finish the elephant so don't tackle all of the tasks straight away prioritize your tasks um, also uh, whilst working it whilst working on your on your goals try and put your phone on the airplane mode because I know it's 21st century it's social media everywhere um, uh, we get the signals uh, of our notifications on our phone which might distract us so put your phone on the airplane mode because it's so easy nowadays to get distracted um, because attention span of a human being is actually dropping um, we have lower attention span than the uh, chimpanzees nowadays so Prioritize on the most crucial tasks first, uh, tidy up your working area, and also separate the environments where you rest, where you uh, work, and where you exercise. So all of these tips are here to make you more productive and make you achieve your goals. So thanks for watching guys, and I will see you in the next video. Take care.